Hi, Dyslexic Genius here. My name is Brad Hurt. My phone number is 864-236-1680. Today I'm going to show you how to adjust the lead screw and the half nut on a Triumph because this is more on the top of the machine and you can see it. There's some discussion online. Off camera, I unscrewed the two screws to the half nut. These two screws go to the half nut. I've undone the tension screw and the two back screws. So what you want to do, this is the hand, it's up off the lead screw, it's down on the lead screw. So we're going to leave it down. What we're going to do is make sure that the spring, all this, is 90 degrees to the lead screw. So I got that 90 degrees to the lead screw. Now I'm going to show you, this is the half nut. And you can see the half nut wiggles. If you can see this on camera, they wiggle. Okay? So I'm going to set this down. I'm going to use my piece of computer paper that's three thousandths. And you need to use a screwdriver. I'm going to set that. So what I'm going to do, we're going to back this off right there. You can see the half nut. You're going to take your little screwdriver and you're going to crank it in till it hits. You can see that come down. Now you want to make sure that the half nut is engaging this perfectly. The round part is here. It's not back or not forward. So you're going to screw it down. You hear that? Now it's engaging. There's a little play here. Okay. Now you're going to take and tighten the top screws gently. And using the computer paper, it's on just like that. It needs one little more twist of the tension, a little bit, and there you go. So when you set the track, you set the tracking, you play the machine, if it's not engaging, you're going to take the tension rod, this tension spring in the middle between the other two screws, and you're just going to give it a little turn, a little turn at a time. To you get that. You want it just floating. This isn't complicated and that's my tip for the day.